anything is not a problem for me. But in the future, happen something with you, will be a problem. Okay. I will be arrest. <laughs> This is Graham Rahal arriving on the scene. Full car shallow, full car shallow. peças de carro e o alambrado. Olha o alambrado voando lá para o pedaço do alambrado vai para cima ali do público. E aí você vê depois o carro do vídeo tomando a Deus e estampando o carro do Takuma Sato. Você viu o Graham Real passando? Ha sido el medio al través el que el cual yo me he comunicado, he sentido, he, no sé, me he esforzado, me ha dado mucho. Yo creo que, fíjate que me ha ayudado a que en un momento dado en el que mi vida está en peligro, haya hecho una María tan fuerte como para como para superarlo, como para salir adelante. Ha 
ha hecho lo que yo soy. <ríe> sí. bonus And the speeds we have here, 222 miles an hour. I mean, just fantastic speeds here today. You expect that in the race? Absolutely. I think that was a little bit faster, but uh, this is going to be a spectacle. This is a great way to go out um, for the IndyCar Series in 2011. We know we've got the new cars and multiple engine manufacturers coming for 2012. So uh, we're excited and uh, grateful to Honda for sponsoring uh, this particular race. Good luck today, Dan. worried about going into this race was all that dirty air created by 34 cars but right now the position he's in he actually has a small advantage because everybody else has opened the air up in front of him and he Whoa, oh here we go trouble, trouble contact and a huge crash oh. up in turn number two. Oh, multiple cars involved Dan Weldon may be involved in it. And Eddie, you and I spoke about this this morning on the drive-in. Just this amount of cars, the speed, just the chance for what they call the big one. And what happens in conditions like that, you, when you're even, if you're 300 yards behind that, you cannot stop these cars. What, the only option you have is to try to avoid it. And it was Im impossible to avoid anything there. I, I went into racing because it was dangerous. It was one of the things that attracted me. And I think that one has to have certain things in life that make a bigger call on you than, not, than the norm. And being dangerous did. Motor racing shouldn't be safe. That's what it's called. It's a dangerous sport. But, but now you're more likely to get killed playing paint polo. In the back of the ticket, it says motor racing is dangerous. And it still is. Don't get it wrong. The wrong accident can happen. In my period of driving, there was only a one out of three chance I was going to live. There was a, a two out of three chance I was going to die. To survive in that period of time, it's, it's not a question of talent, it's just a question of pure luck. What is so important about driving faster than anyone else? You should know that by being a racing driver, you are under risk all the time. And by being a racing driver means you are racing with other people. And if you no longer go for a gap that exists, you're no longer a racing driver. Because we are competing. We are competing for win. And, and the main motivation to all of us is to compete for a victory. It's not to come third, fourth, fifth. It was not courage to pass it. It was, in fact, de la precision technique. C'était l'envie de faire mieux que le tour précédent. Voilà. L'envie de faire mieux que le tour précédent. You're there to be the best. You don't uh, fight against the track. You, you fight against your competitors to be the best. The fantastic feeling when I'm able to put a quick lap. The feeling going to the corner, sliding the car, controlling, drifting the car, breaking the limit. In motor racing, I think a driver 
man is getting to the brink of life and death, perhaps beyond any other activity that man enjoys today. I found that if I learned to be careful, if I removed emotions, whether they were highs or lows, I could perform to a better level. Emotions are very dangerous things. You're just a passenger. When something happens that quickly, there's nothing you can, there's nothing you can do about it. Io sono una persona che vivo di emozione, tante emozioni, anche se ci sono delle volte che non dimostro perché non 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 voglio dimostrare, riesco a guardare dentro di me. Però nella mia personalità, nel mio carattere devo avere tante emozioni per mantenermi motivato nel mio non soltanto nella mia professione, però nella mia vita. E correre per me è un modo di vita. Correre per me è un modo di ridere, un modo di piangere, un modo di, di espressare i miei sentimenti. It's not just sadness, you're just angry. You're shocked, you're angry that the sport could be as bad as this and as negative as this to have such violence. On a pris conscience que on pouvait se tuer même c'est pas de sa faute. Une pièce mécanique qui casse de l'huile sur la route, vous savez que si on tapait on pouvait voler. In the end the race always goes ahead because of the commercial implication. And they start praying and asking God should, should they still continue, should they still do this sport. I love this sport. It's not because something is wrong with the sport. I think that to drive very fast around the circuit requires a tremendous amount of self-control because the limit of driving very fast and going over the limit takes a tremendous amount of concentration. Kimi Raikkonen. Okay, Kimi, we need to keep working all four times, please. Keep working all four times. Yes, 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 yes. I'm doing all the time, so we don't have to remind them to check it. The escapatoria has gone. No, pero está en la pista antigua ahora. Sí, sí, sí. A la pista antigua se ha ido. Ostras, tú. Increíble. Pues lo más bonito que han hecho por mí
fantastic! Incredible! Nobody has ever seen the finish of a motor race like that! A lot of people go through life doing things badly. Racing is important to men who do it well. When you're racing, it's, it's life. Anything that happens before or after, it's just waiting.